Well, imagine losing your electricity during the heat of the day. Well, it happened to a Melbourne family. In fact, they've been without power for a week. Mm -hmm. Florida Power and Light cut their electricity, claiming that they've been stealing power. The family says that's not true. They reached out to News 6 investigator Eric Sandoval to help them get results. Michelle White's ring doorbell camera was powered up and recording last Wednesday when this Florida Power and Light worker dropped by. FTL sent me to, to inspect a new meter real quick. White says the worker shut off her power and left, leaving this note saying illegal tampering with FPL's equipment has occurred at your location, and the tampering has caused the meter to improperly under-register the electricity that your home has been using. There's a jump in here where somebody in this house has been stealing electricity. But White says she doesn't know who tampered with the meter on her 1,000 square foot house in Melbourne. We paid May, June, July, here's August. I get a bill and it says your bill is, your bill is ready to be viewed in the amount of $12,000, $12,245.92. They say they're not able to come up with the $12,000, especially when they say they didn't do anything. We contacted Florida Power and Light. And they say they couldn't comment on customer accounts, but they did tell us customers are responsible for ensuring their meters are not tampered with. If tampering is detected, we may backbill a customer. Now, Knight and White say that they have not been charged criminally with anything because they say FPL can't prove they did anything. They say they're simply stuck footing the bill. And they say FPL isn't budging. Eric Sandoval. Getting results, new six.